Assalamu alaikum everybody, hello. Yes, I am standing in front of the most photographed structure in the world, Dome of Rock, or what we call Sahara. Important in both uh, for Judaism as well as Islam. This was built, the structure was built on what was a hill back in the day when Prophet Muhammad went up the skies. This was built, the mosque was built around it, around that structure I'm going to show you from the inside, the, round, the rock. Let me just give you a very brief uh, um, context here. In Judaism, this is their holiest site. Because the foundation stone that we're going to see inside is for them a connection between the physical and the meta world. According to them, it's the first matter to be created. And God used the clay to create Adam. Adam, sorry. Adam alayhi salam. Judaism ke mutabik, ye unki sabse zyada holiest jagah hai. Kyunki jo andar rock hai, wo ek connection hai unke liye physical dunya mein aur meta world ke liye unke mutabik ye pehla ek matter hai jo jo khuda ne banaya tha aur usi mitti se khuda ne hazrat adam alai salam ko banaya islam mein hamare liye iski sirf ek importance hai ki yahan se nabi pak sallallahu alaihi wasallam allah taala ko milne gaye the क्रिश्चियनिटी इस बारे में खामोश है कोई उसके इसके इस बिल्डिंग के हवाले से कोई उनकी कोई बिलीफ नहीं है चलिए आपको अंदर से अब दिखाते हैं सो आई एम एंटरिंग थ्रू वन ऑफ द मेनी डोर्स आई नीड टू स्टोर माय शूज फर्स्ट It's quarter past 12 here, so I want to film everything before Zohar prayer. So let me show you the rock. यहाँ से नबी पाक सल्लल्लाहु अलैहि वसल्लम ऊपर गए थे। ये आज भी उस चट्टान का ओरिजिनल स्ट्रक्चर है। It still it is the original structure of that. hill or mountain, call it whatever. And this is what I can show you. This is the sign of the Barak. The three of them are the fingers and this is the AD. The footprints of the hoofs of, the, of, the, um, of Barak, the horse that came to pick Muhammad Wasallam. That horse belonged to uh, Angel Gabriel. Jibra'il alayhi uh, salam. Jibra'il ka tha wo. And this is the sign of the horse's feet. उसके निशान हैं आज भी आइए लेट मी टेक यू डाउनस्टेयर्स इनटू द केव And I'll show you something very interesting here. The Chitan, that piece. We'll go actually under it. This is the ladies section, the men section. And let me point out this hole. So when Prophet Muhammad وسلم, left, or Barak actually carried him up, 
up there in the skies. The pressure was so intense that this piece of rock actually wanted to, was dragged along with him because of the pressure. Some major physics happened here. And then Gabriel, the angel, had to put his palm down to retain the rock to stick where it was so that Prophet Muhammad could fly up. Ye wo ek surakh bana tha jab Hazur Pak Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam barak ki back pe upar ki taraf gaye to chatan saath hi uth padi to physics ki wajah se ye ek surakh ban gaya pressure ki wajah se to Jibreel ne apne haath se usko niche kiya us chatan ko ki wo zameen tak hi rahe Men are praying on that side, so I'll take you there in a bit. This is the part of the wall, this black section, that was kissed by Prophet Muhammad because it was such an overwhelming experience for him. He bent down and kissed that spot. I'm sorry, no. This is... So while I wait for the men here to finish praying so I can go in, kiss that spot, relive the sunnah. It is believed, again, according to many Islamic narratives, chronicles, history books, Tabute Sakina, the uh, uh, what's, what's the word in English? Um, the uh, oh, I'm thinking of it in French and uh, Urdu now. The covenant, the box of covenant, which holds all the secrets of the world, is hidden under here. So under this spot, it's confirmed information, by the way. There exists an entire system of caves. They did the research. I'll come back to that point, but let me just show you this. So, as I was saying earlier, that there was a saying earlier that the hidden treasure. The Bhuti Sakina is hidden somewhere here. There's a whole system of caves under it. Um, nobody would dare to, of course, go in and research. It's guarded heavily by Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Kaha jata hai ki jee tabute sakina iske niche chupa hua hai. Koi confirmed confirmation kaise ki iska ye pata hai ki iske niche ek gharo ka silsila hai. Koi himmat nahi karega jaane ki kyunki Allah Taala rakhwali kar rahe hain. So I got out of that area <laughs> just to show you the beauty. It is believe everything is like it's gold plated, right? And since its construction, only once has it had its uh, touch ups. That's the hole I was showing from down there. On this note, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala enable all of the Muslim to come to this sacred place to pay respect to see the beauty and the and to and to feel the calmness despite all the noise around me 
اللہ تعالیٰ ہم ساروں کو توفیق عطا فرمائے یہاں آنے کی آسان رستے کرے اور یہ ایک ادھر مسجد میں اس مسجد میں نماز پڑھنے کا لطف اللہ تعالیٰ ہم ساروں کو عطا فرمائے سی یو آن مائی نیکسٹ ایڈوینچر اللہ حافظ بائی Very quickly, I will show you the spot where it is believed that the remains of Muhammad Wasallam's hair is resting between the rocks. And uh, such a nice amber smell comes out of it, which is sent um, from Saudi Arabia, I believe. کہا جاتا ہے کہ اس کے نیچے اس ان پتھروں کے نیچے حضرت محمد صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم کے بال ہیں اگر ہم آج اپنا پورا اس میں پھیریں گے تو اندر سے امبر کی خوشبو آتی جو کہ سعودی عربیہ سے اسپیشل بھیجی جاتی ہے کاش آپ کو خوشبو سنگا سکتی بالکل امبر کی بیوٹیفل